welcome to Coxie's Picks. If you like what you see, don't forget to subscribe. Enjoy. Hello and welcome to Coxie's Picks and today we're going to be looking at a Chubb battleship. This one was sent to me by Deadlocks and uh, it was sent down to me as a very rusty ball of chalk and all well, the lever pack was seized and you couldn't pick it, you couldn't get any movement in it, everything was, it was just like, for, for all intents and purposes, it was a paperweight. So what did we do? Well, we did some evapo rust. we gave it a little bath in that, and as you can see, it's cleaned up lovely. And some features that we found now is it was made in 1969, and we've also got the Chubb London Fishy Keyway, which I'm sure Deadlocks will be super happy with that. However, just because we put some rust on and we made it clean, uh, unfortunately all the lever pack was still rusted and still seized. So I then had to put it into an ultrasonic bath and it spent a good 24 hours in the ultrasonic bath and the amount of crud and uh, detriment oh, garbage that fell out of this, bits of paint and useless bits, um, was phenomenal. So we then got some movement on the levers uh, and then I was able to successfully open it. And so now I've picked it closed and hopefully I'll be able to repeat the actions on camera. Hopefully. Um, Chubb battleships are notoriously difficult to pick, um, so we shall do my best to try and get it done on camera. <clears throat> and I'll also try my best to show you what my hands are doing as well. Okay, so I've gone into the back of the keyway with my tensioner, which you can make yourself. This one's from Andy Mac, and I've also got an Andy Mac uh, pick wire. What we're going to be doing is we're going to be lifting the levers up as we're going along the pack ever so slightly, just nudging along until we get a little bit of movement and then we're happy and we're looking for a binding lever once we find the binding lever we're then going to try and lift it into its right position whilst providing tension on the tool so let's just go along and still got some movement still going and as daft as it sounds you're just going along until you find a binding lever and then you lift it up until it stops binding and it sits nice and snug and goes a bit stiff so little movements all the way if the whole lock binds up then you've gone into a false gate which is a bit of a pain and you're gonna have to start again so okay fingers are slipping Oh, I think I hopefully I didn't drop my tension. Yeah, I did. Never mind. Let's go again. I haven't picked lever locks on camera for ages, so I apologise if you're not seeing very much. But. Oh, I got myself jammed up. Come on, don't be evil. Okay, that's it picked. But the problem is, is that my tension tool is not long enough to throw the whole bolt. So, what you need to do is you need to tap it. And there we are, we've picked it. So, now I've got the fun task of picking it closed again. But one of the cool things is, is now that I've cleaned it up, you can see that we've got two-tone metalwork. So, it's like a brass shackle. I've not seen that before on a Chubb battleship, but definitely an interesting discovery. So, Deadlocks, hope you're happy. And everyone else, thank you very much for watching. Stay safe, and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.